former President Edgar Lungu's economic advisor, Hiven Mwinga, is reportedly unwell to have his alleged corruption trial commence before the Economic and Financial Crimes Court. His lawyer, James Matarillo, has informed the court and asked for the matter to be adjourned to November 14, 2022. The state did not object to the defence application. However, despite Magistrate Irene Wishimanga granting a plea for an adjournment, she expressed concern on the non-availability of Mr. Mwinga's sureties before court. Magistrate Wishimanga has warned that she will issue a warrant of arrest against Mr. Mwinga should the same situation happen when the matter comes up next matter. Mr. Mwinga, his wife, Mercy, and son, Harantu, are facing 66 counts under the Anti-Corruption Commission Act, with each count punishable by up to five years in prison and a fine. The accused who plead not guilty to all the counts are said to have acquired various properties and cash in dollars reasonably suspected to be proceeds of crime. Among the properties includes a double-story flight in Osaka Zaibexi, which Mr. Mwinga purchased at 1.5 million kwacha, and some houses in Silverest Gardens, all valued at 4.4 million kwacha. Other properties include two properties in Chilalabombwe, valued at 2.1 million kwacha, among others. His wife, Mercy, is accused of acquiring more than 11 vehicles, which include an Isuzu D-Max, two Hino trucks, a Mercedes-Benz car, a Dyna truck and a Toyota Alphard, all valued at 1.3 million kwacha, and another property in Salama Park, valued at 20,000 United States dollars. While his son, Hagantu, has been accused of owning various motor vehicles, reasonably suspected to be proceeds of crime, among other properties. In another court story, Economic and Equity Party President Chilofiatali has also made an appearance before the Lusaka Magistrate Court on one count of assault occasioning actual bodily harm. He is accused of assaulting a police officer, Melod Malama. According to the police, the incident occurred during his detention at Chilenje Police Station and a keto is alleged to have been used to inflict the pain on the victim. His trial, which was supposed to commence on Wednesday, October 19, 2022, has been adjourned to November 10, 2022. Darius, join you. Time on news.